A dream is just a great idea that doesn't have a website yet. Make it a reality with Squarespace. It's never been easier to turn your business or passion into a unique website. Whether you're a bespoke hoodie designer or you want to showcase your hand-drawn portraits of the original cast of Star Trek, with Squarespace, you can create a custom online presence with just a few clicks. And there's nothing to install, patch, or upgrade ever. Head to squarespace.com hi for a free trial. And if you're ready to launch, use the offer code H-I-G-H to save 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. <laughs> hey everybody, welcome to Giving Dogs Waffle House. That doesn't make any sense. That's from Rush Win R-A-R on our uh, Patreon. The next show, you got to sign up for uh, Patreon. Uh, become a member of the 420 Club at patreon.com slash getting Doug because the next show we're going to draw another winner. Uh, today, there's going to be some winners in the house that, uh, uh, you know, live in the area, so they chose to come see the show. But if you don't live around uh, Los Angeles, uh, then we will uh, try to set something up for you to see uh, out on the road somewhere. Uh, for instance, I'm doing the Doug Loves Movies podcast at The Secret Group in Houston, Texas this Saturday, June 9th at 420. And then I'll be at the Gramercy Theater on Wednesday night, uh, June 13th. That's in New York City. And I've got shows uh, throughout this month coming up in St. Louis, Kansas City, Vancouver, Canada, and Pittsburgh, U.S. For all of my road dates and details, go to DougLovesMovies.com. And enjoy the show. <laughs> Blast off, here we are on uh, voting day in, in many places. Uh, I voted today, I'm very proud of myself. You're welcome, America. And uh, I'm joined by a, an old old bee and a newbie. We've got <laughs> Kelly McInerney and Reggie Watts. Yeah. I'm the Nubian. <laughs> you and I, you are, well, perhaps you're a Nubian, but you're also an old bee uh, in my mind because you've been on the show before. I have. But maybe a couple of times. Uh -huh. And before we went live, you were talking about how you uh, are more of an edibles guy, so this is the most smoking you ever do is when you come on this show. Yeah, I come on this show, and this is the most smoking I ever do. All right, thank you for, thank you for verifying my statement. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say that. It's like, we were minute. just sitting there waiting to start. I don't know what you're talking about. But what's going on in your mug? Are you trying to show off that mug? I don't know. Well, I don't know. I just got it. It says, what, what could matter? No, what matters? This is the group nine. What matters? Copyright. Caffeine. No, oh, what, what matters, matters now? now? <laughs> Copyright. Caffeine. <laughs> wow, what a fun mug. <laughs> so much to ponder. Uh, Kelly is a uh, Los Angeles comic and uh, podcaster yeah. who has a show that I very much enjoy the premise of. I haven't done it yet, but uh, tell people about your, your podcast. Sure, it's called IMD Weed. Uh, <laughs> we go to the movie Stone. Yes, yeah. oh my God. And then okay. review the movie immediately after. I love it. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> what, what's the most recent one wow, that you did? I want to do that. Yeah, super fun. Uh, we just did Deadpool 2. So oh, you, go, mm -hmm. so you yeah. go with That's the guest and you make sure that you're high first and you watch it and then do you get yeah. high again to do the podcast part? It depends on the guest. Some guests are not super stoners. So they they'll just rather just... be high during the movie yeah, part. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You don't need to re-up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I got you. But we go and smoke in my car. Oh, like that's like so in high dope. school. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Oh, and you that record, so, you so record that part too? Nah. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh. That could be some bonus material. I wanted to, yeah. but my co-host was like, no, let's not record in a car. In oh, the for insurance lot. legal reasons? I don't know. <laughs> maybe maybe if you got, you know those, those she locks? She is Jewish, so she locks. probably knows oh, law stuff. Yeah, that's true. Gosh, those, those people of Jewish descent. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I miss the days, Reggie, of uh, being out yeah. on the road and uh, you know hearing from you like, hey, uh, 
uh, I'm in town as well. What's the edible situation? And I would try that's to true. I would try to hook you that's up with so stuff. Funny. That's true. <laughs> I totally forgot about that. <laughs> but we got a lot of stuff on the table right now. We've got a sativa and is loaded into most of the things it's called. <laughs> okay. uh, it's called Snowcap, but we have wow. an Indica standing by called Blue Steel. Oh, I've had Blue Steel. If you're into that sort of it's thing. It's Remington. Yeah, it's, um, uh, I like it. Does okay. it make you do the Blue Steel? You know, it does, I will, I give it to, when I when I give it to people, because I have a third party, you know, cartridge for the Pax Era or whatever, and um, and I give it to people and they're always like, oh no, this is too, it's too up, it's too up. They're always like, it's too up. And I'm like, oh, I like it. Okay. I just want to <laughs> tell you that. Just giving the information, guys. They probably ah. like sleepy, sleepy indicas. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely. Like super sleep, super sads. I yeah. like super sad strains. Yeah. Like the sadder the better. It's like, oh, I can't wait. Mm. Like real blue steel. Yeah, blue steel. So grab any one you want and okay. take a hit. Grab I think anything. we might be late now. Okay. okay. All right. Oh, we <laughs> might be late. It's 421 somewhere. Oh, shit. I didn't How not realize bowling? that. Oh, dang. Yeah, you just uh, uh, carb it on no, the end there. Dang, and then, this is cool. Okay. Yeah, oh, we I call like it the Lebowski one. pipe. Whoa, this has got an eye It's on. got a creepy eyeball Wish on it. Wish it was an extra lighter. Oh, there it is. Yep. Mm -hmm. We usually There's have enough. Three of them. And you never take these off? I always take these off. You don't own it until you take that off. Oh, really? Really? Why do you take them off? I take them off because it's dumb looking. It looks like I don't own it. Like, because you have a bar. Unless you. Gonna resell it and use the barcode? No. Okay, mm -hmm. see. Wow, and it actually had like the name of the company that made the lighters like underneath it. Like why would they put the label over their own name? I don't know. They don't know what they're doing. They don't they don't know what they're doing over <laughs> at cottonmouth.org. Oh, org. This <laughs> dot org. <laughs> Cottonmouth dot, dot gov. <laughs> um, this shit's real. <laughs> oh yeah, we put real weed in the, in the I pipes. Mean, I thought it was okay. Yeah, yeah. I didn't know that. We're not doing oregano. No. It's not that yeah, TV I thought, weed. <laughs> TV weed. Have you on any of your programs, the uh, Late Late Show or uh, Comedy Bang Bang, had scenes where you've had to smoke fake weed? Uh, I don't. Because they generally don't let you smoke real weed when it's a TV show. I know they don't, but I always but wonder. If they like, want to do the gag. California, though, like since it's legal now, can you can you just? Smoke it. I mean, I, I know I can. I Yeah, I know I can as well. <laughs> and, we and did have. on High Court. High Court was all oh, real yeah, and on was, TV. Oh, yeah, that was real, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't know why I'm talking like this. <laughs> oh, yeah. You're being really honest. Hey, what's going on, guys? <laughs> yeah, we did too. <laughs> <laughs> we. All right. Uh, yeah, so, oh, okay. Yeah, I'm don't not. let me keep you from smoking. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, I didn't I just, mean I'm to talk to you while you're trying to take it. I'm shocked that it's real. <laughs> We've got some winners from the 420 Club. I mean, everybody in the 420 Club is a winner, but uh, came down to uh, enjoy the show. We'll get, we'll get some pictures and do some social meds after. It's not a cigar. Oh, it's a, yeah. You're Popeye-ing it. <laughs> you Popeye I'm that Popeye shit. the inhaler man. I'm Popeye the inhaler man. <laughs> Instead of, uh, what is it, spinach, you just, you need different greens. No, I mean even greens. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's what they meant all along. They just called it spinach. Oh. Yeah, it was always pop. I was, you know, just smoking weed and then beating the crap out of people. There, there was an episode where they were referring to it as jazz spinach. So. <laughs> <laughs> Is that real? I can eat me jazz spinach. <laughs> oh my god. Right. Uh, so Kelly, it's your first time on the show, yeah. so we just have a question we ask Ow! everybody when they've never been on before, and that's uh, we want to know about your high history. Okay. What uh, was the first time? Like, do you remember your first experience yeah. with smoking weed? I do. It was uh, me and my two friends from high school. Uh, we were supposed to go to uh, like a Spanish uh, class trip uh, for Spanish class. In case you, uh -huh. that, you didn't get that. Like, well, within that case, we should learn yep. the word marijuana. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> but we, yeah, we, yes. we didn't show up to school, and we instead <coughs> uh, smoked at my friend Claire's house. Uh -huh. But she didn't have any papers, so we used Rolling Stone magazine instead. What? Can you do that? You used a magazine page? I get, we did it. and <laughs> As a joint? Yeah. Oh, she, wow. like, rolled it. That's rock and roll. Weird. And, um... Yeah. That's... That's yeah, awesome. Yeah, Rolling Stone, I get it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, that was next. And you enjoyed it that time and have been at it ever since? Kind of, then Basically. Did you get high that first time? No, I don't think yeah, so. Yeah, I didn't. But then, like, prom weekend, we went down the shore, and uh, we found this guy that sold weed on, like, the Atlantic City boardwalk, and then we smoked again. ATO. And then I kept doing then it after it was, that. Then it was on. 
yeah. from then on. That's so mm -hmm. cool. Wow, did you get like mega stoned when you got stoned for the first time? Were you like laughing your ass off? Like, what was it? I think I, I was kind of both drunk and stoned. Oh, you're drunk. So it's hard Sweet to combo. tell if I was really stoned or just <laughs> very <a> try. drunk. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it works get great crunk. for me. That's like what they, do they still call it that? Crunk? What, was crunk? What, oh, crunk, drunk and high I is crunk. I thought crack. I thought it was drone. Oh, I thought that was dr stone. Oh, Droned. that makes more sense. Well, now it does, nowadays. Because <laughs> people really love drones. Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit, you guys, I got droned the other night. Oh, you, you were attacked by a flying machine? No, I got drunk and high. <laughs> oh, stupid. Oh, 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 yeah, sorry, wait, wait, sorry. Okay, sorry. Oh, God, I love drones. I was in uh, Austin, Texas the other day, and a gentleman what? gave me this uh, uh, piece of glass Look at that's, that. um, you How know, you... not the most practical no, for smoking I was out of. Say, like... But I'm going to try anyway. Okay. I'm going to give it a whirl. Like a stain but it's there. like an art piece, you know? I'm Maybe it's a, like a, it's, a donut. Donut. it's a laying down one. You yeah. lay down. You, it's when you, for when oh, you're laying yeah. down. Oh yeah. You know you're just saying? laying down, yeah. sipping on a little mm -hmm. something. It's a, it's a park pipe. I like that this bowling, <laughs> this pin looks like it's pooping out smoke. Oh my god! Is oh, it, okay? it just keeps it's going. You should, you should just, I know. You it should does. try to hit that. Try to finish no, it off. It won't work. <laughs> <laughs> no, you try it. I guess. Is it working? Yeah. Is it? I'm just a little bit. Yeah, let me let so me see. I don't know if it seems like it. Check it out. See if it works. Uh, kind of. It's really mild. Yeah. So it's okay. Let me turn up the dial. All right. I'm going to give this thing a whirl. No, same. Same. It's got All a right. carb and everything. Got to light it up again. Yeah. Okay, so I'm in a park. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you're, hey, you're get a leash for that Lying dog. down on a beach? Trying to smoke in this park. <laughs> He's laying down. It's a nice day. See the clouds. You hear there. birds chirping. There they are. Tweet, 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 tweet. Mm -hmm. Tweet, tweet, tweet. Oh, I'm, so I'm so glad this pipe <laughs> brought me here, and then I can't use it at home. Woof, woof. Oh. Yeah, it's not bad. <laughs> That's yeah. kids laughing. Yeah. Does anybody want to try it? Do you yeah. want to try it? Yeah. You just gotta, How do you do it? You just got to hold it at the right angle so that so the weed doesn't just fall out of the yeah. thing there. Yeah. <laughs> Don't let it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that's good. Yeah. Yeah, it seems to be good. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, it's a good. Just yeah. a little awkward feeling Bravo. at first. Yeah, it's yeah. not the you know, but yeah. that's what you get when you you know when you're smoking out of a piece of art. Oh, he's gonna lie. You can also yeah, you're gonna you can also finger it. Do do what it's supposed to do. Okay, here we go. I think you dropped the weed. Oh shit, <laughs> you motherfucker! Did. Oh, did he? Uh, yeah, he did. Give me some new weed. Oh shit, new Quick. weed coming in. Quick. Here it comes. <laughs> uh, I'm dying. Emergency. I need weed. <laughs> Help, All doctor. Right. He's weeding. Okay, I got this, I got this. <laughs> but yeah, be careful, because it's going to fall out again very easily. If you yeah, don't. Just... Okay, here we go. Oh, carb. Yeah, it's got a carb on it. Carburetor. Mm -hmm. Carburetor. Would you help me <laughs> make this <laughs> car? <laughs> I like that you see the smoke. Yeah, it's, it's cool pretty, that right? It's clear. Yeah. I mean, this doesn't look like he's got a drug problem. <laughs> I'm such a wussy smoker, too. I'm like, just a little bit. Just, a, just a, not too much smoke. <laughs> That's really nice. All right. Thank we did you. it. We did it. Thanks, guy from Austin, whose name I don't remember, but maybe we'll do some research and give him a proper shout out. Yes. What if his name is Austin? Yeah. Oh, I make it so easy for me. Austin Banks. I met this guy in Dallas. <laughs> His name was Houston, so it was confusing. Oh, that um, sucks. <laughs> see you Saturday, Houston, and see you guys in a few minutes. We'll be right back. Support for today's show comes from Squarespace. Think it, dream it, make it with Squarespace. Squarespace has beautiful templates from world-class designers that make it easy to turn your idea into a website that's as unique as you are. My friend Amanda from Akron uses Squarespace for her dog sitting business and to sell her paintings of people's clothed butts. In just a few clicks, she's able to customize everything from her website's look and feel to settings and products. It's easy to chart your growth with their analytics and your site is optimized for mobile, 
right out of the box. If you have a question, their award-winning customer support team is there to help you 24-7. Keep dreaming, but make it a reality with a website from Squarespace. Head to squarespace.com slash hi for a free trial. And when you're ready to launch, use the offer code HIGH to save 10% off your first purchase of a website or a domain. That's squarespace.com slash hi, offer code hi. Guys, let's talk about sex, good sex. Are you ready to put the pep back in your step, the banana in your pocket, the wood in your pecker? Blue Chew, that's blue like the color, brings you the first chewable with the same trusted FDA approved active ingredients as Viagra and Cialis. And since they're chewable, they work up to twice as fast as a pill. From now on, every night can be prom night. Even better, Blue Chew is prescribed online. No more awkward doctor visits or pharmacy lines. Blue Chew is made in the USA, cheaper than the pharmacy, and ships straight to your door in a discreet package. Right now, we've got a special deal for our listeners. Visit BlueChew.com and get your first shipment free when you use our special promo code DUG. Just pay $5 shipping. Again, that's B-L-U-E-C-H-E-W.com, promo code D-O-U-G, to try it for free. Blue Chew, the better, cheaper, faster choice. A weird fight. We are back. We are here <laughs> with Kelly McInerney and Reggie Watts and joining us. Yeah, you can applaud again if you want. Yeah. yeah. The producer of the show applauds. Everybody join in. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and, um... We are here with Alicia, who's going to take a hit first to do this proper Whoa. like. Whoa. Before you can she, still do uh, it even when you take a hit? Before I'm she a really us, serious news anchor, right? She's going to give us some real important pot stories. But it's pot really topics, just that it's will. always been a dream of mine to smoke this close to your hair. Oh. Is really <laughs> all it's coming down to. <laughs> yeah, you'd be great um, to go somewhere with where smoking's not allowed and people could just blow it into your hair. Yeah, totally. Yeah, yeah. to hide oh, yeah. the smoke. Yeah, yeah. I'd be like, no, because yeah. I'll use it later. You could probably hide. You could stash like lavender up in there, like really hide it. I put it all there, and then when I wash it, I just like take the liquid, and then I process it, and I separate all the ingredients, and I have weed again. Nice. (laughs) Wow. I've always wondered. (laughs) (laughs) What does he do with all that hair? What does he do with all that hair? Must be weed in there. Um. So let's talk about some news. Mm -hmm. So going back to uh, 2016, Florida (coughs) did legalize medical marijuana. Um, And now poll numbers are showing that Floridians are also in favor of legalizing recreational use. Oh, okay. And so, yeah, this next next election is really big. Um, There is anti-cannabis Republican Governor Rick Scott. uh, But he's leaving office. He's leaving. And Democrats really believe that it's uh, going to come down to weed in this election. Nice. So, yeah. You You mean that's the only thing? Well, no, so when it comes to the Democrats specifically, there are uh, oh. three of them that are in full support of complete legalization. Okay. There is one who's just yeah, right. max decriminalizing it, which is um, still, you know, a big I like, step. I like that. But, yeah. Any step's a step. Yeah, mm-hmm. that sounds great. Yeah. Now yeah. you got to vote on those people based on their other positions since they are all pro-weed. Maybe. Yeah. yeah, but I don't think any of the Republicans are, so maybe keep that in mind when you vote. Yeah, weird Florida. Just hit that Democrat. Yeah. Weird if Florida does Button. something good. <laughs> it's just weird that Florida. <laughs> it's just, it's just weird that Florida. I love that. It's like, it's you guys like, want to know that. something weird? Florida. <laughs> <laughs> But I love it there. You know, they've got all the great theme parks. That's what's got, really good. Yeah. Universal's great. Mm. Yeah, and never any, been to one. any kind of Same. really weird news story tends to come out of Florida, so that's always fun. Mm-hmm. God. I had a season pass for Universal here. Really? What was that like? Awesome. Was it was it just cool to just have the pass, or did you use it? No, let me tell you. If you want to have an edible oh, and go no. to a theme park. Oh, okay. Oh, you're right. That's God, the best. I've never all done right. that. I've never done that. I mean, I oh, went dude. once, and I will say that the morning when I was still high was a lot better than the afternoon when I was not <laughs> can I'm confirm. Telling you, man. Uh-huh. <laughs> mm-hmm. Harry um, Potter land. Let's get another oh, pot yeah. topic. Or the Stormtrooper that thing with the VR integrated thing. Okay. No, you're good. This looks so good. 
on you, by the way. This I, is a really nice, yeah. Oh, wait, really? you're talking about the VR thing with the Storm <laughs> yeah, Troopers? Storm Troopers, It's yeah. fucking great. Yeah, you've done it? Yeah, yeah. yeah it's the, at my, Downtown my, Disney. Oh. Ooh. Yeah, it's those guys, The Void. They did the yeah. Ghostbusters one in uh, Madame Tussauds. Do you like it to shoot them? Oh. Um, this is the whole game? That? Yeah, it's like, it's like you're wearing a you're wearing a VR headset with a backpack computer. Okay. And when you put it on, you when you look down and you look around, you have a Star Wars setting, you look down, you look like a stormtrooper, you see your other friends, they look like stormtroopers as well. You're mm -hmm. on like a shuttlecraft and then you yeah, go you around and you look at your own arm move. and it's stormtrooper arm. Yeah. And you're holding like a Like you're just gun. a fucking stormtrooper. Wait, so are you wow. fighting the good guys? No, well, you're just fighting monsters, know you know, because, you <laughs> I've know. Been on it. They give you. They tell you about the mission ahead of time. You're, we're we're pretending to be star like in the Star Wars: A New oh, Hope, okay. where like disguises yeah. mm -hmm. or like Finn and it's the, it's like an actual micro story that they actually snuck in there because there yeah. there was a woman talking. They about, filmed with a couple of the people from Rogue One. Yeah, that's right. Uh, yeah, they tie it in. in. It's a real tie-in. It's like yeah. it's like it's like in the movie in Rogue One, you're cruising down a hallway and you see a droid going down the hallway, but the camera keeps going forward. Mm -hmm. They'll take the droid going into the hallway and create a, a micro experience. It's not necessarily this Sheesh. one, but a micro experience in some other format, a video game, um, uh, an Instagram clip, whatever. Yeah, yeah. They'll just like, it's called transmedia. It's like a but new part thing. Of the, part, part of the harness is when they shoot at you, you get a, 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 like shocks in your chest, like you're oh. being shot. But Shit. you know, the, but the stormtrooper armor, you know, can probably <laughs> block it. Block. For the I'm first anxious shoot. just hearing about this. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I feel it's that. Really, <laughs> I mean, I, I it's feel really, it's really wild. Too, but like actually. just just shooting at, at a at a monster and like taking it down is really it's fun. Yeah, yeah. How big are they? Yeah, because you're moving your body, really you're moving in space. Yeah. Everything's mapped around you, so like you. Yeah, and you you're see walking a doorway, on these gang planks the where VR there's just well. where you would fall if you went to either side. Of course, they they do it safe because you don't you can't see, but it's uh, like the whole time you just really feel like you're in this environment. It's really cool. Wow. Yeah. Oh. Well, let's pretend yeah, so we're back in the 1930s is my transition. And <laughs> okay, <laughs> so, before uh, Star Wars. <laughs> <laughs> so tell us about the Star Wars news. Uh, so back in the, in the 1930s, uh, marijuana was medicinally used because of the Marijuana Tax Act of 1937. Oh. Uh, wow. Which was a national campaign. Um, so <laughs> I really love this story. I'm sorry. Uh, some of the uses for medical marijuana back then included um, a sedative, which I think is fair, um, for treating Ooh. asthma. Okay. Uh, it was a topical ointment that people used on their feet for bunions and corns. Nice. Uh, it was also put in a mixture of indica and licorice to treat gonorrhea. Wow. Um, oh. Yep. Okay. Even better, hysterical You're women. You're gonorrhea. <laughs> 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 hysterical <laughs> women were given cannabis to, uh, you know, hysterical treat. Oh, yeah, oh yeah. my Anything God! Calm PMS, down, woman. <laughs> from That's PMS so to true. stomach pain to nervous depression, uh, but it was also Makes used sense. to treat an overactive sex drive. What? what? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, no, that makes okay. sense. Yeah. Yeah. sense yeah. right? Because some people take get so mobilized, they're <laughs> yeah, just like yeah. the furthest thing yeah. they're thinking. Yeah. Which you'd think you would, but you know, a little, right? I, I don't, don't think it hurts performance, but it definitely hurts the, just the, the, the idea, idea of, of, it. of doing yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. yeah, yeah. Like, oh, I'm too high to go no, in the room no. and no. take off a shoe. It's like I'm having so many, we're just laying next to each other. That's just great. I love it. I really love it. It's like, yeah, I don't need more than this. <laughs> Who was that? I, I don't know. Where'd that I don't guy know. come I don't from? know. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> that was the woman in the 1930s. Yeah, it was. <laughs> I don't need. Yeah, that's how she sounds. <laughs> I'm hysterical, yo. Uh, so, in other news, MedMen. Oh, um, yeah. Yeah, Love MedMen them. is great. Big LA based chain of dispensaries. Yep. Mm -hmm. um, so, they can't trade on Wall Street because cannabis is still illegal, but they can now trade in Canada. Oh. Mm -hmm. wow. Can, can. So that's can going to be a Canada. stock in Canada. The, the, uh, On the Canadian Securities Med Exchange. Men. Yes. Oh my gosh, mm -hmm. so they're just going to be making money so as a U.S. company. Yeah, yeah. With it's, it's the United States there. missing out on all that opportunity. More and more U.S. companies are doing it because... Yes. Oh Wait, so they have like the New York Stock Exchange, but the Canadian version? Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, cool. The Canadian New York Stock Exchange. What's, yeah. what's the uh, what's the abbreviation? Do they, do they well, say? it's the Canadian Canada. Securities Exchange. So, what what would it be, what would it trade under? Like, what would be like the, the identifier? Oh, I don't know. We'll have to look that up. Okay. That's a good question. I like that. I wasn't prepared to actually oh, okay. get people investing. <laughs> I wasn't trying to. Like... 
<laughs> no, no. Batman I just, is not hiring me to be here well, right now. I we'll put it up on the screen if we remember to where to go to invest your money. Call one eight hundred. But I mean, um, can, do you have to can be you, Canadian? Can, yeah, can Americans even invest in Canadian yeah. stocks? Oh yeah. I wonder if that's true. Well, yeah, I guess there must be a way because right, WTO. I don't know. I mean. <laughs> Daniel's hot, hot on the case. Uh, yeah, He'll I'm, look not, it I'm up. not sure what the legality would be. Yeah, we can move on to another okay. topic. <laughs> I'm and, curious. And Daniel will tell us uh, if he finds it. All right. Okay. <laughs> so this story I, I think is really interesting. I haven't really heard very much about this, but in order to keep up with the state, with California's marijuana industry, the California State Senate has approved a measure to create a bank for the now legal economy. Oh. Yeah. Well, wow. I had heard nothing of this. So is, I, I was like really excited. That's fantastic. Yeah. A weed bank? Yeah. A weed bank. A wank. Yeah, that's really what. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Marijuana bank. A wank. A wank. It's still federally legal, so those regulations make it really difficult to bank. And so as a result, most businesses do cash, and uh, that comes with obviously a lot of problems, especially security being one. Right. So now that they're going to have um, these banks, which you can thank uh, actual, actually a senator here from uh, Van Nuys. Um, Shout out to Van Nuys. Yeah, yeah Van Bob Nuys. Hertzberg. The Valley is in all that. <laughs> Van Nuys. What's his name? Van Nuys. His name is Senator Bob Hertzberg. Hertzberg. He's a Democrat from Van Nuys, and he introduced a special charter bank that would issue checks for use by account holders. And uh, yeah, the new bank would increase safety because now they can, yeah. you know, hire people to, to come protect Wait, themselves. Wait, in, in California? Mm -hmm. Cali. Uh, yeah. Cool. Yeah. Damn. All right. Okay, so it's getting so real. That's, that's yeah. getting so you realer. go there and deposit your weed and then you can come back and get it when you want it? It's yeah. a business man. <laughs> yeah, that sounds right. Yeah, that's what they it is. They store it perfectly. Yeah. Yeah, Bless totally. you, Daniel. What do you have for They're us? They're like, no, we don't need banking for the money. <laughs> we need it for the weed itself. Harry Potter level <laughs> bank. Brokers do not permit trading in international stocks, but fortunately, Canadian stocks have become an exception to the rule in some cases. Oh. The exception. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, maybe we'll go. be able to get some meds. I like it. Stuff. Yeah, go invest in the Do you know what it, what's the it trading under? What's the moniker? <laughs> For the cannabis? Stock? For yeah. med, for MedMen. MedMen specifically. Oh, MedMen. Well, I wonder if it's MMN. What do you think? Yeah. Mm. I used Lisa, to, Sarah, seems, Sarah seems right. Josiah. I used to trade stocks on a thing called Neopets. What? I love Neopets. Yeah. Neopets. Fantastic. CGC. Oh. That's Canopy Growth Corp. Oh. Oh. Okay. CGC. 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 That feels weird. That's sick. Get that CGC. <laughs> I'm the count of CGC. <laughs> CRON. Hey, no, CGC. Like chronic. You know, okay. sometimes it's oh, not CGC. Oh, they're just taking that you know, already. <laughs> so one of those Stop things it. owns MedMen. <laughs> yeah, and okay. then yes, they own MedMen, and then um, uh, yeah, they're both traded. Oh, so it's a comp That's the company. That's the and, and master company. And this interesting here, Corona parent company, Constellation Brands. Has a steak in Canada. Oh. Corona beer. Corona. Interesting. This mm. is this is getting Corona more is intriguing. Still at a party. There are secret alliances forming in the shadows. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, you know, because it's alcohol companies that always get uh, people point the finger at them for like all the yes. anti marijuana ads and stuff. Mm -hmm. Like right. they're just trying to keep because. Because, you know, they haven't figured out, apparently, that uh, drunk people <laughs> Love yeah, weed. So smoke weed yeah, yeah, yeah. and high people also drink. Yes, <laughs> that's so true. You know, that's so true. I didn't even know they that. They go hand yes. in hand. So, I don't, so Corona, good, if, on, good on them for figuring it out. What if they make a weed beer in the future? That's what I'm talking about. I think they will. I'd never leave my couch. I mean, they've made weed sodas, so that doesn't sound Yeah, we have like lotus, we have <laughs> yeah. Sprigs. All right. Shout yeah. out to Sprig. Sprig. And some others. Good old Sprig. 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 Sprig, you know, when they first came out, I was like, I need some sugar free, you know? Yeah. And they and listened. That, I gave them a slogan idea they didn't yeah. use. Sprig his sprug. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't like it. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> What's wrong with them over there? <laughs> it's <laughs> spridiculous. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Spridiculous. <laughs> oh, well, you got any more topics? I do, I do. Uh, um, See, it so moves along great when I could just say to someone else, Please. talk about something else <laughs> I now. Know. I love it. <laughs> I'm so grateful. Uh, so back to Florida. So a year and a half ago, they legalized medical marijuana. And now 91,000 Floridians are buying 56 pounds of weed a week under the orders of 1,400 doctors. And this program is registering <laughs> registering 5,400 new users per week. Wow. Yeah, Florida is wow. crazy. They're on man. it. Well, you know, there's nothing like getting high in warm weather. Mm -hmm. It's a real sweet combo. <laughs> and the theme parks. Yeah. yeah. And then right. you just go to Disneyland and 
lose your mind. A world, I should say. Apologies to everyone hurt by that mistake. That's incredible. (laughs) (laughs) Um, There's a slow movement by state regulators uh, as far as who can grow and sell weed and how patients can take it. Five companies have been authorized to own dispensaries with only 37 locations to serve the entire state. So they're delivering pretty far at this point. Yeah. Uh, Yeah. There is still a statewide ban on smoking medical marijuana, though. It has to be through an oil or a tincture, an edible. Oh, Um, you mean smoking the flower directly? Correct, yeah. So it has uh, to be like a refined weekend. form. Right, but many patients are yeah, saying that they would prefer it. So there was uh, a Leon County judge in Florida who did recently rule that the smoking ban is unconstitutional. So. Oh, well, that's yeah. that's fantastic. Wow. Yeah, I that's mean, great. medicine, that's, you that's shouldn't be strange... able to regulate how they take their medicine, mm-hmm. you know? Yeah, it's a weird... Makes perfect sense. Yeah. That makes sense. Well, thank you so much, Alicia. Absolutely. You can find her on Twitter at uh, Alicia L. Glass. And uh, what else do we need to say? Anything before we go to break? I think that's it. All right. Thank you for Thanks, being everyone. here. Thanks for those pop topics. I didn't know it was going to work. You. That was so really great. Yeah. <laughs> that was, that was uh, very nice. We will be right Nova. back for dab time. We'll see you in a few minutes. See you in two. Hey, everybody. I wanted to let you know about a new podcast called Bad Science. Each episode breaks down the science of a movie, pairing scientists with comedians to chat about it. I was just on the show, and I got to talk to two physicists about Back to the Future. Back to the Future, one of your favorite films, is that correct? I do enjoy it quite a bit. It's fun to think of it as a science film. Sure. Some would call it an incest movie. That's true. They have other great episodes, including one with our friend Reggie Watts, talking about Star Wars and upcoming episodes with Jessime Peluso and more. Search for Bad Science wherever you discover and listen to podcasts. That's the opposite of good science, bad science. Oh, we're, are we coming back in? Oh, okay. Yeah. That's always funny. <clears throat> like on the uh, the old David Letterman program, they did a bit in the mailbag segment where somebody wrote in and said, what is Michael Jackson saying in Billie Jean? <laughs> 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 is he saying... <laughs> Is he saying chair <laughs> in, the, in the line where it's the, what he's supposed to be saying is kid? Huh. Oh. David Letterman goes, let's take a listen to it. <laughs> see, see, see what he's saying there. Mm-hmm. And then it's just some old white guy on the, on the Letterman staff when it gets to that word going, kid. <laughs> <laughs> kid. It is not my son. It's so silly and funny. Oh hey, uh, speaking of silly and funny, it's time to uh, dab with the dab master himself. That's me. The dab king of greater Los Angeles. Taylor Rizzo is here, everybody. Yay, Yay Taylor Rizzo! Yeah. Along with Kelly McInerney, whose podcast is called I Am D Weed. Yes. And it has a wonderful premise that we talked about earlier yes. in the show. Just rewind. And, and Reggie Watts, <laughs> yes, yes, uh, just another so wonderful <laughs> premise. <laughs> And <laughs> that's what you are, Reggie, a wonderful premise. <laughs> oh, that guy is the premise. Yeah. Where, nice guy. <laughs> where do you all stand on dabs? Do you do them? Is it something you like? Are you I willing refuse. to try it if you have it? I refuse. <laughs> no, it's fine. You can refuse. No, it's, I don't. it's an option. A lot of people have that <laughs> no, no, stance no, no, no. on them, I feel like. No, you want to know my, my, my dab history? I would love real, to hear it. Real quick. Uh, I did dabs at the O2 Comedy Club in Portland. Uh-huh. Um, there was someone backstage who like made their own oil or whatever, oxygen extracted, mm-hmm. blah, blah, blah. And they were like raving about it, and they're like, yeah, here's the dab. And I was like, I don't know what that is, I don't know what that is. And then finally I was like, you know what, I'm here, I'm backstage. I try it, he does the whole thing, all glass thing, glass rig. Sets down there, puts the little glass tube on there, I go, I take a massive hit, I sit down, and then I'm just like, it's just like, Someone tapping me on the shoulder and like going, excuse me, and then just a freight train hits you. <laughs> and so I was just immobilized for a while, and I was like, no one needs to be that high, yeah. ever. Like, why would you, okay, so that was my first experience. Then there was a person <laughs> on Twitter who was mentioning that they're into dabs, and I was like, okay, dabs, 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 yeah, let's check it out. So um, I was just like, I just said, come over 
to my house <laughs> and, and, and we'll try dabs or whatever. So I was just taking a chance or whatever. Uh, they came over. Dabs. They, yeah. Then she came over. She was really sweet. She was really nice and she grows it herself and they do, uh, it's like pressed rosin or whatever yeah. is what they do. And, uh, was her name Dabra? <laughs> Dabra. <laughs> Dabra. It was Dabitha. <laughs> Dab no, it was Dabitha. It was Dabitha. No, I just called her the Dab Queen. I don't know, but it's partially That's true. That's my wife, actually. Oh, what? No, my wife. That, uh, my queen. <laughs> but, but it was amazing, is what I'm saying, is that that was incredible. And I was like, oh, that feels really nice. So all that to so say. You've had two sure, experiences. <laughs> you're 50-50 on it, is what you're saying. Yeah, like, oh, but This I, one could push you over the edge today. Yeah, I'm like, I'm like two for one. I've had two great experiences okay. for one not great experience. All right, well, I think we're going to take it up a notch and go three, if, you, if you're okay. willing to try today. Yeah. I'd love Kelly, to. where do you stand on, on dabs? Is that something you're willing to do? Yeah, yeah, where, yeah. Where, my where one friend Coleman's? does it all, all the time. She's crazy. She, your like, one friend. Yeah. The one friend you have is just dabbed just the down one all the friend. time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and she just, she is crazy because she'll take a bunch of dabs and then like go do stuff. And I don't know how she can do that because I Yeah, that's next level yeah, for sure. I do. Yeah. It's called talent. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It is quite a skill. Yeah, you build up a, you know. Uh, Still, let's start tolerance. things off. You know, you know the weird thing. I'm just too lazy oh, for this. Taylor's yeah, like, yeah, I the first a lot. This is the opposite of a sto what a yeah. stoner should be. Well, this is more Give scientist. Me, yeah. This is like if you want to throw some science I'm in too there. Too lazy. Mm -hmm. Oh God, it's like pretty to look at too. It's, it is like science. Oh my gosh, I love it. You know. That's so cute. When science and art collide. Yes. It's like, when science whoa. and art collide. It's dangerous too. Cute, that, but thing, dangerous. that thing gets really hot. It is hot. Yes, yeah, there so is a like if I, <laughs> if you touch it, it will hurt. It yeah. will burn it. It will turn you off of that. Just give it a slow tap. Like that. Why? Why don't you? I always get third degree burns. <laughs> Boys end up in the hospital. Yeah, totally. I don't like it. I don't know how to hold it. Building burns down. So do you know what uh, what we're dealing with here today, Taylor? What kind of concentrate? Yeah, this is uh, just a little bit of crumble. It's uh, CO2 extracted, so there's no butane or anything in nice. it. Nice. It's sativa, so it's going to be a little bit lighter. It won't put you right into the couch and immobilize yeah. you for yes. multiple yeah. hours. Yeah. Like it's like systems powering can be a worry. Down. Systems yeah. powering down. Yeah. Systems <laughs> powering down. Critical core damage. Like <laughs> yeah, you don't have anything else you have to do today, do you? Yeah, I have like a lot of stuff. I have to talk to Lisa. Uh, no. <laughs> Lisa. <laughs> I was going to do laundry. Yeah. Yeah, yeah well. so you could probably still do that. Not anymore. Yeah. Yo. No. You, you know. Probably not. You might, be a, <laughs> you might be a little late on, uh, you know, changing the loads or whatever, but, <laughs> you know, I'm sure your neighbors will understand. <laughs> That's the fun thing about dabbing is uh, like you can do it like in a hotel room and they don't, uh, the, nobody you know walking by knows what's going on in there. They, they know it's science <laughs> yeah. from the sounds, yeah. but the smell right. does it doesn't smell like you've been smoking weed. No, it's right, got a yeah. different smell. Yeah, what does it's, it smell like? It's like metallic, isn't it? Well, you it? can kinda smell it right now, can't you? Kind of. Not really. Yeah, it's or just yeah, uh, it's it doesn't it's have a nutty. doesn't have a really strong. Yeah. It's just lighter. Yeah, it does. It's not. A, you're not actually combusting. A plant, so it it's just like if Febreze didn't smell terrible. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Less carby stuff in it. Yeah. All it's right, like let's give it a go. Febreze. Talk him through it. Reggie oh. Watts on oh, sorry, the Sorry, I keep hitting my microphone. Yeah. Sound guys, like I hate this guy. Um. <laughs> <laughs> just touch this guy in here. It'll all melt in there. We'll cap it, and then when I pull the cap off, you'll just clear go the for hit. It. And go for it. Then success. Uh, go for Watts. Right. Go for just it. let me know. Yeah, go for now. Yes. Does the wire make it hot? Is it plugged in? Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. Because you've seen a lot of people that have like a whole torch that they use. Yeah, that's what my friend This has. is like a machine that gets it real hot, so you don't have to fuck with the torch. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's a really smooth smoke. Yeah. Yeah, keep it a, a yeah. temperature really helps out. Right. Like uh, a lot of times when people use the torch, it's harder to regulate where you're getting the temperature, so people hit it a little hotter and it's a little harsher on your throat. Yeah. And, that is another reason that people get turned yes, off by dabs. Totally. And so, yeah, they get assaulted. It's fun There's to like, take those Q-tips after he like cleans it out. Yeah. They're, they're real hot. Put it right in your ear. Oh yeah. my yeah. gosh! Yeah. Next one. Q-tip in your ear is Next really <laughs> sounds bad, but it's not. No, it's, no, that makes sense. It's, <laughs> Probably like like a sauna, like an if ear. It start, if it starts yeah, to hurt, like if it starts to hurt, push it through. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you'll, the you'll other take way. it out the other side. It'll be fine. <laughs> Whoa! I never knew that. The show is so educational. <laughs> it, it is. Totally. I'm learning so much. Super edge. All right, so Kelly's gonna do one. What we'll give her a, uh, like a medium sized one. Does that yeah. sound yeah. about right? Flower of life. Sounds yeah, right yeah, to yeah, me. Yeah, that's good. 
Yeah, yes, you just got seven days of uh, kind of all right luck from touching that. <laughs> Yeah, thank, thank the Larry. Things aren't gonna be amazing, but like you'll 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 you'll, you'll, you'll appreciate. I do like that there's no blowtorch though. Yeah, uh, that is cool. Yeah, electric electric rig is really kind yeah, of. Yeah, can nice. you do that? Yeah, go for it. A little harder. Yeah, there you go. Keep going, keep going, and there it is. Boom. Yeah, that's not as bad as. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> My friend. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute, what? <laughs> what though? <laughs> she wants you okay. to finish your sentence. <laughs> Someone doesn't want to share. Uh. <laughs> I'm okay. Yeah, no, it's, it's, it's you're also probably very high. <laughs> it also yeah, really have a different type of isn't that bad. <laughs> I know. I felt like I'll <laughs> have what she's having. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um Kelly's got a podcast you can check out on iTunes, IMD Weed, and you can follow her on Twitter and Instagram. D Weed. At, this always confuses me when I see your name on there because it's not Kelly. Holly Weirdo. Yep. Holly Weirdo. That's me. Yeah. It's a, it's a really good handle, but I get confused by it. <laughs> <laughs> I told you Kelly Magner and he was mistaken. Oh. I don't know, I don't know why. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. This okay. is a hilarious yeah. typo. You can sense. follow Reggie Watts at Adam underscore Newman. That is <laughs> 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 not even close. <laughs> what is your Twitter handle? Me? Yeah. Uh, me Twitter handle uh, <laughs> Reggie, <laughs> Reggie Watts. It's just your name, right? Reggie Watts, yeah. yeah Instagram, check, check Reggie Watts. Checkmark and everything? Yeah. 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 Yeah, for some reason, a previous yeah. guest's wow. name got on there. It's, uh, and that's not your Twitter handle, but he was great, Adam underscore Newman. <laughs> uh, but you could check out uh, Reggie's new album, Casual High Technology. That's correct. That's what it's called? Uh-huh. And uh, <laughs> also, how's Taskmaster? Tast ma Taskmaster? Taps, how's Flaps Caster? No, Flaps Caster is amazing. How's that show <laughs> going over there on Comedy Central? Uh, it's great. We're filming a lot. No, we're not. We we, uh, we shot a long time ago, so. Oh, yeah? Uh, yeah. They're rolling them all out now? And yeah. And people are enjoying it? I, I, I've seen the you know commercials. And it looks very funny. Yeah, I think, I think people are enjoying it. I seem to get a fairly positive sense of it. Um, right, and there have been right. some great, some nice reviews, so. Okay. You should see it. Yeah. Yeah, the premise is that you're the taskmaster, so you yeah. give uh, the guests on the show uh, ridiculous things they have to do. Yeah, yeah. So, the, yeah, the idea is, you know, really the mastermind of the show is, is Alex. Um, he's the guy who formulates all of the tasks. I'm basically like how power functions, which is just a figurehead. Right. So, uh -huh. so I'm, you just sit there and say it like you're telling them to do exactly, this thing. Exactly. Exactly. I mean, I that. own the. I mean, I own the. Own it. You know, I try to own it. Yeah. But, but it's but it's and it's fun that way for me because I'm like I'm there in real time when the show's happening, yeah. just like they are. Yeah. So everybody's real time, which is. What nice. are the tasks that they have to do? Like eat a. Give us an example. Donut with their hands behind their back. Or yeah, something? no, that's that's close. There's yeah. one where we take where you're supposed to take a hot dog and like move it over three inches. Really? <laughs> what? Is it your mind? <laughs> are you no, trying to it. are you trying to find mutants? You could. You could. Doesn't say you can't. It's not in the rule. Yeah. yeah. So why are you trying to? There's another task where. Wow, you created a whole TV show because somebody needed a hot dog move. <laughs> this, yeah, this one. This one. This other one is oh, like you need to like what stack. What a taskmaster. Task. Yeah. Ta task. Oh, no, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Anyways, that's what it is. Yeah, it's 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 that happening, and then we ask people to you know they send they go out to the field and they perform these tasks. They each perform the same tasks on mm -hmm. separate days, and then they come together in the studio and then they see how each person tries to solve the task. And it's kind of fun because it's all happening in real time. The every all all the reactions are there when it's being revealed. So it's it's nice. It's like a real everything is sincere on it. It's really nice. Yeah. I love it. Cool. It's, and it, what, what, what's the time show. slot? Is yeah. it after a really yeah. sincere show like uh, Tosh Point Oh? Saint Elsewhere. <laughs> 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 it's Saint Elsewhere. Uh, let fun. me. Uh, can I do it down? Comedy yeah, yeah. Central. <laughs> yeah, you're awesome. Sorry. Finally, funny Saint Elsewhere. Oh, yeah. St. Elsewhere was yes, funny. Where? Ed Begley Jr., Howie Mandel, <laughs> Denzel Washington. Well, Denzel wasn't funny, but... Denzel, for on what? I want to see Elsewhere. him be no, funny. Yeah. He has been funny. When was he last Has funny? he been funny? I think he have role where funny. There you go. Um, let me think. 
Oh, he's really doing that. Didn't he do something? Oh, man. Whoa, he really, yeah. He yeah, knows how to yeah, do Yeah, Doug's that. pretty proficient. Yeah, he's very, very proficient. This guy <laughs> smokes weed. Yeah. Yo, turn out this dude. He smokes <laughs> weed. Yeah. <coughs> no, that was good. <laughs> that's, yep. that's beautiful. Day changed. Here we go. That's beautiful. That one cough? Yeah, what were we talking about before? <laughs> that's your first concern. Last master? <laughs> really? Not one cough. <laughs> Oh no, we were talking about Saint Elsewhere. <laughs> I could talk about Saint Elsewhere a lot. I got a lot to say about it. Oh no, you were saying uh, funny Denzel, and I'm, right. I'm afraid that he has m yeah. moments of levity, but he's yeah. not a he doesn't play right. funny parts ever. Yeah, you're right about that. Yeah, he'll yeah. be kind of funny for a second after he murders somebody. He's like the small charming. humor in a, in a dark character. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm but trying he's, to, his know, charm. I'm trying to think charm. of him. Did he didn't he do a parody of himself or? Am I just remembering so many parodies of him? Right, oh, right. You I know? know what you're saying. Yeah. Has he done? Has he? Because uh, I don't think he has. Who was it? He, he has. He's, he's not. He's not one of those people that's ever showed up on like Larry Sanders or something as himself. Yeah. Um, like he never does anything like that. Someone came back recently, kind of recently ish, like like that. Like they they kind of rebranded themselves like into. Oh, like. James funny, Vanderbeek or something. Yeah, yeah, something yeah, like yeah. that. Like, He's like a. I can't remember who was. Denzel to me is like a Sisyphus of actors because. I hope so. <laughs> I because he. Uh, <laughs> He's every year he's in something where he gets a lot of nominations, either a Broadway show for Tony's oh, right. or yeah. Oscar. Oh right, yeah, he's kind of there in he, different he, mediums. He's, yeah, 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 he's in different yeah. mediums, but he's just there in a tuxedo, <laughs> sitting in his chair, like he could not be less happy. <laughs> you know, it's not possible for him to be less happy, and it's like he just he's bringing that on himself because he, you know, he wants the awards. Yeah, <laughs> you yeah. know, yeah, yeah. but he and he does great work all the time. But yep. then he just has to sit through that shit and then not win. And his category is always last or next to last. So he sits through the whole show. What was his, what was his last But thing? he won for training day. He did. So, he did, I mean, in fact. you get one. But that's what I mean. Oh, happy. did he? I think that oh, once yeah. they get one, they should, unless they're unhappy with then something, chill. they send their speech and don't show up for the rest of your career. I know, that's always like kind of, that's kind <laughs> of weird. Why go? You already I, won. I do, I do think about that, like, if someone, like, wins an award, which is really amazing, you know, that's, you know, they, they, they won an award, whatever the quality, that moment is cool. But then, like, after that, like, it would be kind of weird to, mm -hmm. unless you knew that you were winning an award. You know what yeah. I mean? Like to be there to receive the award. Man, I guess I it loses some of the oomph from yeah. after yeah. the first time. Yeah, because I mean, I guess the idea is to show the alum, you know, it's yeah. like, look at the solidarity <laughs> of the alum, you know, like look at all the people in show business together celebrating. I, don't know. I, I get know. so mad when people. Oh shit, 30 seconds. Oh, oh. shit. Oh. Final thoughts. I wanted Leo to win since Aviator. I'll be back. <laughs> really, hard. just Aviator? We will be back like on June 26th, which rocked. is a Tuesday. <laughs> Couple weeks from now at uh, three fifteen. Is that three weeks from now? Aviator. All right. Um, the way of the future. <laughs> right. Here we go, guys. Thank you to Kelly and Reggie and Taylor, and we'll see you again here in the basement soon. <laughs> Fellas, do you feel more deflated than an old bike tire in a heat wave? Are you ready to increase your performance and get that extra confidence in bed? BlueChew.com brings you a chewable with the same FDA-approved active ingredients as Viagra and Cialis, but better. Not only do they work up to twice as fast, but everything is done online and ships directly to you, so there are no doctor copays or pharmacy markups. Blue Chew is the better, cheaper, faster choice. Visit BlueChew.com and get your first shipment free when you use our special promo code DOUG. Just pay $5 shipping. Again, that's B-L-U-E-C-H-E-W.com. Promo code DOUG to try it for free.